this is Kate. In this video, I show you how to use chain editor. First, let's choose a preset chain. And we click this button to open the chain editor. You can see here the child presets are listed here. And um, here shows the number of presets and the estimated running time. And you can use this button to import presets into this preset chain. And use this button to delete selected presets. And use this button to move selected presets up like this. And use this button to move selected presets down. And if we tick insert before selection, and I import one preset here. You can see it goes before the selected preset. And if I untick this button, then we try to import another preset, the same preset. You can see it goes after the selected preset. And we can delete it. And you can see here there are six tabs here. The basic, you can change the name of preset, the repeat chain times, repeat sequence time, and run for hours. You can check the signal here. You can change these set these settings, the notes. You can write your own notes. And the contact tab, uh, you can set settings for the contact and the frequency limits and wobble. Now let's edit this preset chain. First, I want this preset repeat sequence to zero and run for two hours. And for this preset, also repeat sequence to zero and run for two hours. And for this preset, sequence to zero, and also and run for three hours. And I use the save here. It will save based on the original preset chain. If we click save as, it will create a new preset chain. So I use the save here. And for more details about how to use preset chain, you can click help and click help. And here will come up a website about the manual of chain editor. Now let's check whether the preset chain is modified successfully. So we choose the preset chain here. Then go to the control tab, take a lot generator overrides as I'm using the test mode. So there are many generator buttons here. So I choose a generator button. And to check the preset chain quickly we can we can enter the age factor here. I enter the five hundred so and click start you can see about two hours later it changed to another preset And another two hours, it changed to the last preset. It should be run for three hours. Now it's about seven hours. 
and the preset chain stopped. Okay, thanks for watching this video.